I'm down here. What a great run. Whew, but now I'm hot Ugh, and sweaty. And I'm really tired. Hey, why does exercise make you tired? After exercise, uh, you, your legs get sore. And then my tummy gets really, really tired and gray. And then I had to go get some food in the kitchen. I feel like having some lunch. I feel tired. Exercise gives juice muscles. Yeah, maybe. But why does my body feel so tired after exercise? Maybe it's my muscles going on strike for shorter working hours and more oxygen. Oh. Or maybe my body's a bit like a machine and it gets overheated when I work it too hard. Maybe I just need to rest and cool down. Mind you, sometimes after I exercise, it takes me ages to stop feeling tired. Even when I've cooled down, I'm not puffed anymore. I know. Maybe it's because my body sweats when I exercise. It uses up water. So maybe if I drank some water, then I could go for a run. Hey, if I drank heaps of water, then I bet I could exercise and work my body for ages. Yeah. Topping up the body with water, starting now. Body is all filled up with water. It's ready to work out and sweat out. How about a run? Oh yes. My body definitely feels like a run. Ooh. Well, water didn't seem to be what my body was looking for to give it more energy after all. Well, not that much water anyway. My body machine excretes and sweats water. But I think there's something else it needs. Machines use up fuel when they work. And my body is sort of a living machine. So maybe my body is a bit like a car. Yes. So let's take a look inside. This is the radiator. It's full of water. And it cools the engine down when it's running. The water absorbs the heat that the engine creates when it's working. A bit like the way my body creates sweat to cool my body down when I'm hot from exercising. But water in the radiator does not power an engine. Petrol does. A car needs petrol to fuel it. And when it runs out of fuel, the car stops. Well, what kind of fuel does my body engine need to fill up on? I've got an idea. body uses. And I've got enough fuel here to keep me working for days. So, 
How about a picnic? I've got all sorts of different foods here. Body fuel. Well, that's what food is. It's fuel for your body. Food has energy in it, and your body needs that energy for exercise and hard work. Well, some foods, those that have lots of sugar or lots of fat, contain more energy than others. And if you eat too much food, your body converts that energy into fat and stores it. The amount of energy in different foods is measured in kilocalories. Each day we need between 2,200 and 2,900 kilocalories of energy from our food. A gram of fat contains nine calories, and a gram of fish contains only one or two calories. Oh, real fish, not chocolate fish. Well, before my body can use this fuel, it needs to digest the food in my gut. And then it's carried through my bloodstream to my liver and to my muscles. My body is an amazing engine, and it's quiet. It's quieter than a car engine. Excuse me, it's normally very quiet, and it works well. And what's more, it uses renewable fuel. Not like those petrol guzzling car engines. Yes, my body is a great little motor and it chugs along by chemical reactions in its cells. The chemical reactions use oxygen to convert food energy into other sorts of energy, like kinetic energy when I move. Food energy is converted into another sort of energy too. Heat energy that keeps my body warm and makes me feel hot when I exercise a lot. Just walking around uses up three to four kilocalories per minute. And running fast uses about 15 kilocalories of food energy per minute. Even when I'm just sitting, my body uses up about 1.1 kilocalories of food energy, just keeping its motor idling. When I'm working hard and exercising, my body's using energy faster than normal. So that's why I end up feeling tired after exercise. It's because my body's energy is low. I need to wait until my body has made some chemical reactions and turned some food into energy for me. So when my body's feeling tired, a good thing to do is refuel. Ooh, thank you. That should fill up my fuel tanks nicely. After I've eaten, all I need to do is sit back and relax and let my body go to work with all those chemical reactions. Then with a bit of luck and some body chemistry, I'll be feeling full of energy in no time. This is the life. Catch you later. It's a funny looking banana. <laughs> I'm trying to say feeling. Ah! Hey, Mum and Dad, thanks for paying your broadcasting fee.